Hello everyone, my name is Aidan Dunlop. Um, I'm one of the NGMO field guide students that got placed at Lion Sands. Uh, I'm just going to talk about a couple of things that I've experienced for the last couple of months. Um, so I know for the induction period, everyone or every new employee that starts at Lion Sands has to go through this period. It normally lasts for about six weeks or so, something shorter than that. But you just go through every department and you, you really learn the basics of each department, all the way up to maintenance, housekeeping, laundry, even, even in the kitchen. Um, and it's, it's, it's really, really, it's quite valuable because you start learning, we learned a little bit about it at college, you start learning how vital a good relationship between all those departments really is and um, how well they work together if they do work well. Um, how everybody depends on everybody, even from me as a field guide, all the way down to the scullers in the kitchen. We all work together. And it's also a really good way for me to learn some faces, learn some names in the new lodge because we come here straight from college and we don't know anyone. So it's, it's really cool to make friends and in all the depart departments and yeah, we cruised like that. Um, some of the highlights after that, it's just, it's just basic stuff that I do around here. I mean, it's, I'm a Cape Town city boy and it's, it's awesome coming to the bush like this and really experiencing just normal things like seeing leopards and doing the elephants and no, normal game drives with our mentors and stuff like that. It really is, it's an amazing place. The sightings are unreal. Um, some of them, I've seen some really, really some unforgettable things, seen wild dogs chasing leopards, that sort of thing. I mean, it really is a quite amazing place. Um, because, of, because of the NJMO College program, we get assigned mentors. And uh, I've got assigned Kelly Oldvicker, and she's awesome. Um, she, really, she really kicked me into gear, and she sorted me out. She put me on, on the straight path, and gave me the best way to do this, do that. And I, and I followed to the point, and the reason why I'm here, so highly now is because of her. Um, I've worked, I've worked really hard, but she's helped a lot. Um, my aha moment is probably just it was, it was this one morning we woke up and it was it was unbelievably beautiful. The colours were just on point. We went out. It was a big five drive. Saw everything out there, and that, I came back and I sat because we all get tents. I sat back in the tents and I was just cheap as I know this is the place where I'm supposed to be. And I was happy. I was, it, was, it was me done. I knew I was going to be here for a while. And yeah, it, it ties into what I want to do for the next couple of years. Is I, want to, I would love to stay here. love to get permanently employed here as a, as a field guide. But also just stay in the bush. Is, um, deep inside me there's definitely something. I need, I need something a bit more wild. Uh, deep in the bush. Something like that. But yeah, this, this place, it's amazing. I mean, I'm, I'm loving every second. Yeah, it's mainly because you really you don't get to wake up in a place like this every day. I mean, this is a it's a very special place, and so I'm living my dream.